Okay, so what we're going to try and do now is edit this bit of scenery by removing the what might be described as power lines. So I'm just going to go along there in that particular area and I'm going to see if we can remove the power line down the actual and uh, yes they've all been removed in one fast swoop which is very good so the next stage is to remove the uh, sections here the stumps Just going to remove that stump right up to the green line here yeah. and see what that produces. So, more or less up to there, and the same on the other side. Now, I'm expecting it to be go green like the grass because geographically that's uh, the nearest area going. Let's see if it does it. Yes, it does, which is encouraging. The next challenge is we've got um, a little bit more erasing to do there. And here we're going to get really careful because the actual squares are quite close. Hmm. Again, just going to bring that in there. Let's all see whether Luminar can actually bring in the uh, nearby location of buildings and both instances, and it does pretty effectively, to be fair. So, <coughs> again, we're going to bring that in there and erase that. That isn't as clear cut, oddly enough. So we're going to have to look at this here and this here. And erase those two areas. Which, oh, you'd have to really be very, very observant to spot that. So that brings in quite a lot of different areas like that, which may not be quite within the coming. And here we go, we have another area there. Now I personally don't think this area here fits in with that grass. So again, we'll remove that and bring that to grass, which works very well. To be fair, if I was to move that here, you would not know that there have been two fence lines and a stump in that area which is quite encouraging and I feel in some ways it's reasonable to stop the video here because we've achieved quite a bit and I might create a second video to promote some of the other ideas I have for this particular image. Ladies and gentlemen if you do like what's being done here then give me a thumbs up or like or share or make a comment. Thanks very much indeed for watching this particular video.